Hey everyone, buckle up. We're taking a deep dive into Taylor Swift's brand new album, The Tortured Poets Department. This breakup masterpiece is raw, emotional, and has fans buzzing with theories about the inspiration behind its gut-wrenching lyrics. Get ready to dissect the heartbreak, analyze the clues, and celebrate Taylor's unflinching vulnerability. Before we start, here one thing to mention for the audience. This video is packed with twists and turns and a surprising revelation waiting for you. So, keep holding till end of the video, as there's much more to unravel. We'll delve into Taylor's next plan, strategy and goals, exploring every twist and turn in her musical evolution. Stick around until the very end for an insider's glimpse into what lies ahead for the reigning queen of pop. Trust me, you won't want to miss a beat or want to blink. And you cannot live without knowing this. Taylor's known for her storytelling, but this time, she's ripping off the bandage and showing us the raw, messy heartbreak behind the carefully crafted lyrics. This album explores themes of breakups, emotional turmoil, and self-discovery with an unguarded honesty we haven't seen before. Taylor's a queen of reinvention, each album a masterpiece, from debut volumes to the 18 tracks on the deluxe edition The Tortured Poets Department. We've got some early standouts like So Long, London and The Smallest Man Who Ever Lived. And of course, there's the epic collab with Florence Welch, Florida. Let's talk about the timing. Taylor's at the peak of her career, both professionally and personally. So, releasing an album this raw is a bold move. It shows her willingness to take artistic risks and explore new creative territory. This isn't just another catchy pop album, it feels like a true artistic statement. The Tortured Poets Department isn't just an album, it's an experience. Taylor's gone all out with the promotion, using social media, music streaming services, and even physical installations to connect with fans. So, what's the verdict? The Tortured Poets Department feels like another evolution for Taylor Swift. It's a testament to her growth as an artist and her commitment to authenticity and vulnerability in her music. This isn't just an album, it's an experience. Now we are going to discuss the undisclosed plans of Taylor that what is she going to do in near future. There are more than one bombshell for the audience that will make the fans excited. Big news just dropped, Taylor Swift is stepping behind the camera to direct a feature film. Details are still shrouded in secrecy, but knowing her talent for storytelling and knack for crafting captivating visuals, this movie is primed to be a masterpiece. Mark your calendars. Taylor's next move is a global takeover following the phenomenal success of the era's tour currently captivating audiences across North America. While specific dates are yet to be announced, rumor has it the tour will hit major cities across Asia, including Tokyo and Singapore, then head down to Melbourne and Sydney in Australia. Europe can also expect a concert extravaganza with Paris already confirmed for a two-night show. Imagine the incredible set list spanning her entire musical career, all delivered with the mind-blowing production value Taylor is known for. Now let's hear your wildest predictions in the comments below regarding the following questions. How do you think about Taylor's masterpiece? Which song resonates with you the most from the album? And how you do predict about the upcoming movie or Taylor's expected tour? Will she finally unleash her directorial vision on the big screen? We'll explore the rumors, the clues, and everything fans are theorizing about Taylor's future. We leave these questions to you, answer in comment section. Subscribe the channel and stay tuned with us.